when I auditioned for it, also, when I auditioned for the pilot, they, they flew me to California for the screen test for it. But first, I'd auditioned for Blossom, and then I'd auditioned for another show called Lenny, which was for CBS. Now, ironically, both shows were written by Don Rio. Okay. And done by Whit Thomas Productions. And they evidently really rallied around me and wanted me on one of their shows. And oh, wow. so they flew me to L.A. for both screen tests at the same time. <clears throat> the Lenny screen test was... I'm sorry, the Blossom screen test was first. Mm-hmm. So they called and, and they told me immediately when I was there that I'd gotten the role. So they oh, did, wow. That's, so, yeah, so they did that's not rare. I feel have like that's me. that's pretty rare. It is very rare. To know right then. Usually Absolutely. Usually there's like a waiting game Absolutely. from what I'm told. Yeah. Yeah. And, um, well, and now there's more, there are more ho- hoops to jump through these days too. But, uh, so they told me right then and there that I had gotten the role. So I did not go to network for the role in Lenny. Mm-hmm. Blossom did not get picked up. Lenny did. They decided to recast the role that the girl who, that I had auditioned for initially for Lenny. And they called me and asked me if I wanted to be on that show instead. So we signed the contracts. Wow. Since Blossom was not going, it didn't matter. So I went and started doing Lenny. Halfway through Lenny, Don Rio himself called me. And I was actually in my little schoolroom on the set. Uh And he called and said, hey, uh, you know that show Blossom? So I've decided, uh, I've tried to find somebody else to play this role. I'm just not, it's not working for me because I've got you You in my head. Like you were in the pilot. That's who I've been writing for since then. Mm -hmm. So uh, I was thinking, you know, how'd you feel about doing this show too? And I love the fact that he called me, not my agent. (laughs) Yeah, that's so great. (laughs) He didn't say my parents. That's like old school Hollywood. Right, totally. (laughs) Didn't say, hey, uh, Gloria, Frank, I don't suppose you guys are going to be all right helping your daughter juggle two shows in school, right? Is that going to be all right with you? No, no, no. He called me and of course, what did I, 12-year-old me say? I said, of course, let's go. 